emergency landing procedure. What's going on guys and welcome to Forever Skies, a game that's been on my radar for a little bit and I've always wanted to kind of post it on the main channel as well. Uh, if you don't know what it is, it's a survival game where we as a uh, player uh, have to build our workshop or laboratories on our mobile base, which is this blimp in the background. So we have to scavenge, hunt, fight dangers and learn what caused the illness of the world. So without further ado, let's start a brand new game and see where this journey takes us in this open world apocalyptic survival kind of game. Right, so here we go. Emergency landing procedure completed. This is us. Emergency landing procedure completed. So if you've played the games like Subnautica, well, this is the opposite. So the game plays the same, but we're in the sky instead of the ocean. <laughs> That's basically what this is. So uh, we've got a hunger bar down the bottom. We've got health, power, and water. Uh, and let's read this. What's here? Documentation. Lost expedition, broken signal. Broken signal. Uh, Sagittarius 2 went silent for months, then this one signal, and silence again. None of us know what awaits you there, but if there is a chance that there is a, they have found a virus, then maybe we can survive. Find the virus sample at all costs. The fate of us all depends on you, the Orc. Nice. So we can see we've got blueprints, to-do list, inventory. Inventory side, we've got an oxygen tank. We've got the database, which is all this is in. But, oh, we'll take that. So we can consume it straight off the bat as well. Emergency escape locked. Oh. All right. We've arrived at the source of the. Look at this. We're at the top of some skyscrapers. There's like weird things flying around. Loads of, like, semen, I think. <laughs> I actually don't have a clue what they are. Health parameters low. Check the database for details. Yeah, we definitely need to find some food. We don't have any form of tools or anything yet, so... Requires solid-state battery. Use the computer. How many cables does that need? Bloody hell. What's this? It's all gone to hell. Everything's begin uh, being screwed, uh, been screwed up since we found that damn virus. We're all getting sick. Equipment is breaking down, and then there's the Noah situation. The power blew out again, and the door is locked. I'll check if the beacon tower has a compatible battery. Okay, can we pick up like? Oh, we can take a can. We can search these places. Oh, can I take a suit? Gloves? No. Oh God. Something's bit his foot off. Hello? Oh god, he's just a corpse. Oh my god, it's a sun melon. Consume. Oh, that was bad. A virus infection. Oh boy. I'm already gonna die. Oh, solid state battery. Here we go. We can use this for the computer. So, this way, wasn't it? I shouldn't have... Why did I consume that in a virus-filled world? Take machine parts. Level is decreasing. Yes, I know. Power. Okay, let's throw this battery in here. Use computer. Here we go. Oh my god, what is all of this now? Undelivered message. Description. We were down under the dust. We found the lab where they f where the first analyzed the virus 400 years ago. That's when it all started going to hell. Noah went crazy. The bastard stole the sample, our airship, and then brought the radio. He just left us here to die. 
He's dangerous uh, as hell. The location of the sample is at an overgrown greenhouse. A scientist lived there who studied flora from under the dust. If you want to get there, try visiting some radio towers and wind farms to get necessary devices. Be careful. The world no longer wants us. It is no place for humans anymore. Expedition Sagittarius 2. Says health parameters. Immune circle. So he here's this thing. This this little circle here. Immune circle determines how hard you suffer from viruses. Value depends on other health parameters. Then you've got a fatigue bar, which I'm guessing is the oh the health bar. Uh, and hunger and thirst. Oh, that's so that's stamina, health. This is the immune thing here. Okay. Cool. I'm guessing we go this way. This light's kind of pointing at us. I honestly don't know if there's any form of enemies. It's a survival game. I'm kind of expecting it. I don't know what to expect. But Bob's your uncle. We'll see where this game takes us. And remember, if you're enjoying the video, give it a big like rating. Helps me out a bunch. Pushes the video to more people. And let's grow this community together. So we've got a lot of flashing things that's grabbing my attention right now. Batteries, machine parts, uh, the virus, which is the Fortobia, looking directly into the sun, causes visual disturbance and injuries. And I, it obviously was caused by the sun melon for me. So if I look into this, oh boy. Don't look at the sun, kids. Don't look at it. Make sure we grab as much as we can. What the? Oh! Is this our blimp? Hello. Control ship. Finish building the airship. To-do list. Find the cure. Place the fabricator on the airship. What fabricator? I don't see a fabricator. What's this? Airship to-do list. I've been building a new airship for two months. Since that bastard Noah got away with our equipment, if only my workshop hadn't collapsed, I would have already had the airship engine research complete. Place the rudder. Place the fabricator. Craft the deck extractor. Extract the wall block in the workshop and get the research station. Expand the airship. Not yet. It needs resources from further locations. Okay, so we need to we need to build a fabricator. There's the fabricator. Perfect. And uh, can we just place it in here? Let's kind of just throw it in this corner here like that. Boom. Okay. Deck extractor requires fabricator. Bed requires fabricator. Simple insect cure. Let's have a look at the to-do list right there. So let's craft the deck extractor. Deck extractor, which is this. 15. We're missing a transformer. We need one of them. Is that water? Oh, it's an empty bottle. Oh, that's dirty water. Let's bot let's bottle the dirty water. Maybe we can fil filtrate it or something. Get more machine parts. More first aids. What's around here? I've got something else we can read. Search these lockers. Photophobia virus research. My research on photophobia virus has shown that it can be cured with le le lectin. Lectin. It's been you. Uh, it's been. Uh, it's been found in dust moths and other things living uh, in the dust layer. I prepared a lure to extract these objects. Use it with the insect catcher on the airship. Lower it into the dust and wait for the catch. The food from the world eaten raw may be harmful. I'll leave a membrane for the water condenser just in case some water will be needed to cook the food. Hmm. Take condenser membrane. Take old food ration. Nice. Okay. Can we get back here? I feel like there's something might be back here. You know? We'll take all of these. I don't know if we have a... Oh, it is. Okay, it's a size of 20. A stack of 20, sorry. Okay, I don't think we can get back there without doing something with this. Yeah, we can definitely get there. There's some bits there. Maybe we need to build something. Oh, there's a yellow flashing beacon over there. So there's the fish trap thing. Add condenser membrane. There we go. 
that's kind of cool. Can we, uh... Dirty water here. Let's bring that down here. Oh, maybe... No? Oh. Oh, it does it... Bottle dirty water. Drink dirty water. We still need a, a transformer. I think the transformer is going to be behind this, isn't it? Oh, wait a minute. Here we go. More bodies. Bottle of dirty water. What is this? I'm just going to take all of this. I feel like we might have to drink it. But we can't get over there from here. <laughs> hmm. Interesting. Oh, take Transformer. It's right bloody there, bits. Here we go. Deck Extractor. Craft. Printing completed. Deck extractor. Insert lore into the catcher on the airship. Wait for water to condense and drink it. Place deck extractor on the outside of the airship. Alright. Stick that there. Extract the obstacle blocking the entrance to the workshop. Which will be that thing. But first... Let's open lore, lore container and uh, simple insect lure. Let's put that on there. And then uh, lower it. Oh. Um, we're going to have to drink dirty water. Not like I wanted to because of obviously the thing, but old food ration. Let's eat that as well. All right. Let's use this. Oh, I can pull everything down here. That's kind of cool. So we're getting like loads of metals. I can't reach this one though. Can we move this? Oh, pick up. Here we go. So, for... what's that sound? It's the fish thing. Take dust moth. Nice. Okay. Whoa. Okay. Oh, the condenser membrane actually broke. Okay. Good to know. I don't know why we can't put these down here into our uh, inventory-like slot here. Maybe I'm just being a spoon. Wait, let me grab the uh, the rest of that. Oh, Jesus. Maybe not. That screeching is crazy. There we go. Oh, workshop. Take solid-state batteries. Here we go. I managed to repair the research station. There are a few old blueprints preserved on the memory card, but the most important one is the scanner. It is necessary, necessary to complete its research and craft it. After that, it should scan certain objects in the world, so we can acquire more data for blueprint research. I need a battery to run the device. I dug it out uh, of this old power box from the ruins. There should be some batteries inside, which I've already collected. Good to know. So, let's grab some of these. Take research to- Ah! I've got no room. I feel like that's in a bad place there, isn't it? Like, I've literally got no room to put this. Let me put that there. Let me pick that up. Let me place that over here. 
and let me pick this up and place that there. Okay. It, it's a bit crooked, so I'm going to fix that. Okay, here we go. Research the scanner. The scanner. Here we go. Metals, we only need five, and synthetics, we need five as well. Water purification. There we go. Water purification. Water. Water purifier. I need more synthetics, which is from these, uh, th these things, right? These, like, giant floating ball things. So let's put this down here. That's metal. That's metal. Them things there. We need 20 of them. Let's grab a couple of more just in case we need some in the future, but... Okay, so these kind of look like they spawn when you get onto this thing. Alright, there we go. That should work. Right, so a water purifier. And we have to place this on the outside of the airship. Also, they do take a little bit of time, but... Uh, craft a scanner as well. Eat what's caught on the cure uh, for Torbia. This? Oh, we've cured it. Nice. Beautiful. Take water purifier. And we've got to place this on the outside of the ship. So, I'm guessing... It did say outside, right? Alright. Pour in dirty water and wait for it to purify. Our dirty water. Oh, that's cool. Purification in progress. Going to take some time. And now let's craft a scanner. What else have we got in here? Oh, I can, don't want to move this yet. Here we go. Check the studies menu. Studies. Synthetic clusters. Communication facility ruins. Research, research station. Tool charger. Repair patch. Empty bottles. Scanner. Machine parts. Okay. Scanner synthetic cluster floating in the air. Research engine fuel. Uh, engine and fuel. I need more synthetics. And let's make some fuel. Battery level 90%, by the way. And then... Uh, Take clean water. Bottle clean water. Now, okay, so we... It actually put five bottle... Well, five water in there. Or four water, sorry. Use. Nice. Some clean water. We just need clean food now. We also need another bottle. I wonder if there's another... What's this? synthetic case. I wonder if there's another bottle I can start putting some... Take candled water. Uh, soda. It'd be nice if there was another bottle, so we can put more bottle of water. Bottle of water. I know there's going to be a lot of comments of going bottle water. <laughs> bottle water. <laughs> Okay, I think we're fine. I think we're fine. I don't think there is any. Okay, craft an engine. Craft an engine. Here we go. Bed. Engine. I need more synthetics. So I've kind of noticed, like, when you click on one of these synth synthetics, it's like an auto-lock kind of thing appears. It's like the thing auto-locks onto it. Okay, can we craft one now? We can. Here we go. I would like to get some more... Oh, wait, wait. Oh, I guess if that dirty water is going to stay in there, then I can put it in there afterwards, right? So, I can't bottle this yet. Requires bottle. Have we got any more lure? Uh, food ration. Lower it.
So when it does the cha chung cha chung cha chung cha chung cha chung cha chung, it's kind of like got something on the end of it, right? Basically, Is that nearly done. There's going to be some things that are going to take a while, so it's going to be good to kind of like travel around and stuff. There we go. Take the engine. Uh, place the engine on the outside of the airship. Nice. I tell you what, the sounds are pretty decent. One dust moth as well. Got this engine here now. Craft, a, craft synthetic fuel. Synthetic fuel. We just need more synthetics. So, word of advice for anyone that does want to play this. Grab as much synthetics as you can right at the start. Otherwise, you're going to be going backward and forward like I am doing. But I'm... Uh, Looking out for, like, how we can extend this... Because we can, like, extend these out to, like, full bases, and I'm, like, all that kind of stuff. So I'm kind of looking forward to that. All right, so let's make some fuel. This is a lot quicker. Refuel the engine with synthetic fuel. All right. Open fuel tank. Synthetic fuel. And depart the location. Let's close that door. Let's close that door. And I think that's a, uh, I don't know if that's a window or it's just saying we can, <laughs> we can move from here. All right, here we go. We're off. We're moving. Fly to the source of the signal flashing. Okay. Hello. We're not going to hear them like, like peepers in Subnautica. We're not going to hear like on the window and ba-dump, right? Yo, this is quite chill. I like this. We can move around. We can lock the speed as well if we want to keep a nice little head in. Put cruise control on. We can press... Uh, what is it? Altitude. Control goes down. Shift goes up. We'll just keep our head in this way and just kind of head to this beacon. I think it's this platform right here. Look at all these buildings just around here. Wonder what city this is. Maybe we'll find out at some point. It's like green toxic lake. It's like we're above the clouds right now, right? I wonder what it's like below the clouds. Oh my god, it's like, it's like a swarm there. Have you seen that? Okay, let's see how it is for um, docking here on these. Let's unlock the speed here. Let's take control. Maybe we can just, like, land on this platform here. Let's try that. Oh... Okay, let's go there, and let's kind of go down. Look at this. I'm a professional. Let's keep that door closed. We don't want to fall off the building. Alright. Check newly discovered objects in the studies menu. Studies menu. 9%. Nice. Communication facility completed. Electric elements. Communication point. Oh, music's kicking in. What's this? Electronic parts. Transformer. Another battery. Perfect. We need that for the research uh, machine. I like this. I like... I wonder if we can make the blimp bigger and everything as well. Because obviously we can extend off this way and make different rooms and workbenches and stuff. But I don't know how much like is implemented into the game right away. Oh, we jump on these plants. Clock 
climb up here. Hello? Take data card. Requires airship builder. Metal flooring. Electric elements. Okay, grab some of these. Take repair patch. Place on your airship. Okay. Let's take this as well. Electric elements. I think this might be the main focus here that we wanted to grab. Are we going to be able to climb down the ladders here? We can. Hands free. Eh. Eh. Come on. There we go. Alright. I've just got to put this somewhere. Let's try it back here. No? Oh, does it... I don't know where this goes. Toggle, snap in, rotate. I don't think we can... Climb on board? Can I just drop it? Oh. It's just the repair patch thing. I don't know why. I don't know why I just didn't look down on my inventory bar and noticed it was down there. So this is to kind of repair. So maybe this is like auto glass replace, auto glass repair, you know? We got a crack in the grass to, s to stick this little bit of chunky play doh on it and something and fix it. Um, but what else? Explore and scan all discovered objects. Oh, yeah, okay, we got to scan them. Re What's that? Wrecking basic turbine increases the flight al altitude of the airship. The effect multiplies for additional unit builds. Find a location with double flashing lights. Oh, there's a thing there as well. These are the water things, aren't they? We've not found out another empty bottle yet, though. I think I might need to go back up there, because there's, there's a, a door as well we can scan. Let's head back up here real quick. Oh! Nearly. Here we go. Let's grab this door. Metal component. Oh, it's just metal components. Okay. Glass components. I feel like we should extract everything we can from here. For our sole survival. What the? Oh, it is a swarm. Threat. Moths forage in large groups to ensure their safety. Individuals separate from the flock to search for the food and return when their hunger is satisfied. The swarm is vigilant and scatters whenever there is danger. Due to their poor eyesight, it will be possible to catch them with the proper equipment. Hmm. Interesting. Well, I think we might have everything we need here. I don't think we can go up this tower. But we can shoo open this up. And take out a battery. Oh. Oh, hello. Hello. Yeah, I don't think we can do anything up there. The question is... Am I going to injure myself if I jump down here? No. There's no crazy fall damage. Immunity is increasing. Nice. Perfect. Research the airship builder. Okay. Let's close that door. Might help with the sound. Uh, I need to eat as well. Uh, airship builder. Here we go. Oh, we've got 16%, so I need more, four more synthetics. Uh, let's quickly eat some food as well. Let's eat that. Let's get on the extractor here and hopefully we can see some synthetics. Get all this metal from here. Whoa! That building actually just collapsed. But I'm not seeing any synthetics. Oh. G 
Keep them coming. Keep them coming. Okay. That'll be more than enough. Oh, shit, builder. Finish that off. Let's get that researching. Research the airship builder. Find a location with double flashing lights. Double flashing lights. There's one light there. Maybe it's on the opposite side of this building. Double flashing lights. Maybe that. Maybe. Let's head that way anyway. Oh. I think I might need to make a bed, you know. How do I make a bed? Bed. I need more synthetics. Because my guy is getting uh, his stamina. He's not filling to the top now. Because obviously I'm tired. So I need to make sure to sleep to get that up. But I don't know how food and water is going to act upon that as well. So let's, let's keep grabbing some synthetics. And then let's hopefully make a bed. Oh, don't, don't jump on that yet. Let's make a bed. That might take some time. Research is done. Craft the Ur Builder. We'll do that just after this. I'm going to guess it's going to allow me to extend onto the base here. And we can make um, a room. Whilst things are being built and researched, this worth just going onto that, right? Uh, for water's sake, uh, we do have some water, so let me just drink some of that. Drink two of them, in fact. And eat that food. I'm worried about other food sources. I feel like we need to go fishing, but I don't know how much that lure is going to... You know, basic lure, lure thing. Oh, shit, build. Here we go. Nice. Can I put the bed down? Uh, rotate. Let's just store that down here. That's where I can sleep right now. I love the free placing, and it's not locked to a grid. That's brilliant. Oh, here we go. Rooms. Build a new room onto the... Oh, a small cockpit room. Ladder room. Here we go. Guess what? We need more bloody synthetics. They're out of range. Okay, where does this attach onto, though? Here we go. Oh. Blocked by equipment. I think I might want to put it at the back here, right? I'm just trying to think how this is going to work, because... First of all, we're going to need to pick stuff up to re remove it, right? You know? So let's uh, pick up the gun. Add a room. Oh, is the engine blocking it now? Uh, container not empty. Oh, let's uh, take the fuel out. And then to break it down. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm working on it. There we go. There we go. So we've got this little thing now. I guess I could just uh, pick up the bed, right? And uh, put my bed over here. But first, we need the uh, synthetic gun thing. So we place down. Oh, that's the... Oh, no, that's very bad. Because if I'm flying in the air, we don't want to be falling off, do we? Pick that up. And then uh, rot rotate it. There we go. That's better. So now we've got this room here. Let's pick up you. Let's throw you over here. Right. Just make things a little bit more... A bit more better. I'm not going to... If... Oh, yeah, if I, I could add in a condenser on that, can't I? I'll fill it with dirty water. 
Let's, uh, let you drink this. Oh, I didn't want to... Damn it. I didn't want to do that. I drank it instead of bloody doing it. Spoon. Uh, find a location with double Build a new wall on the airship. Okay, so we need to build a new wall now. Ah. Plastic wall, metal flooring, doors, catwalks. And you want us to build a wall. There we go. So these don't te these aren't technically uh, closed off. These are open, aren't they? Yeah. So uh, maybe we can make a window or something. Find a location with a double thing. Okay, so I think we're taking off now. I think we've done what we need to do here. Actually, let's grab you and. Uh, Grab this stuff. Might as well. Close that door up. Oh, I need to put the engine back on. Just stick this on here. Oh, it looks like we need to make some more fuel. Which we do in here, right? Uh, synthetic fuel. Let's make that. The thing is as well, we've got to make sure we can access that from in here. Otherwise, we're going to be in mid-air. And we might run out. Right, let's control ship. Here we go. So I think it's this one over here. This flashing area in this direction. Double flashing. That's just that's a single to me. A double to me is two lights. Or it goes blink blink. Stop. Blink blink. Stop. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like that. That is our goal. But I'm guessing all these other lights are points of interest we can explore too. Oh, this is getting dark. I don't know if it's just going nighttime or if it's just getting spoopy. But you will find out what happens next time. <laughs> so thank you so much for watching because it is starting to rain. And let me know if you want to see more of this uh, in the future and I'll uh, get some more out to you as fast as I can. Uh, for the release and hopefully if you do play this game enjoy it speak to you soon thank you so much for supporting this channel and as always keep bloody smiling